Just a tap for him. Back today, guys, to the channel. Back here, Drift CE on the PC for today. We're actually diving into the brand new Chaser update. Uh, this game finally added a Chaser, right? It's really cool to see it, and we're gonna jump right in, I do believe, to the quick race mode. We're gonna drift it around a little bit, see it for its first impressions. I picked it up for, I think, $3, I believe it was. And then we also had DLC. It looks like the MK4 came in, really? The 98? And the MK5? And the Z4? No way! So we at least have the JZX100 today, one JZ, single turbo, ribble drive. And we're gonna go ahead and pick this up and drive it in, I think, red. And then there's also a drift ready version. Let's see this thing. Ooh! With a little wide body flare to it as well? Can I have a better look at this? I can't really, unfortunately. Okay, we're gonna drive the stock version, then hop into the drift spec version. Huge thanks for coming around for today. Of course, don't forget to slap that like button. And the track, I forgot we have this brand new kind of open world free roam, but we also have these toge. So let's run into one of the toges here. Also remember, this game just isn't about driving. You also get to upgrade your car, work on it, upgrade. Drift CE, man, if you guys haven't already checked this out, definitely go ahead and do so. Just a nice cruise, right? See how it does feel on the wheel? And then our handbrake as well too, working. Hey, little bright back here. Let's see how we do here today. Not bad. No, 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 no. <laughs> the camera's interesting. I mean, obviously, drifting on this game in general is interesting. It's always nice to just try something new. I'm excited to actually drive it with the drift spec version now, too. Let's see if the handbrake does much. Oh, it does. Jeez, too much. Diving right in here with this JZX. A little chaser action for today. Oh. Sorry. We're going to quit session. Now this is where it's going to get fun here. We're going to go into the drift spec version. And we even have a custom paint color here, I do believe, as well. Oh. I like that. That's it? 335? I was expecting a little bit more. But I guess it's just upgraded with the 1J. So we're gonna go a little bit of uh, free roam here on this one. Select, no challenges, just drive it. I just wanna test out, see how it feels. Good to be back here on Drift CE. I do believe the PlayStation 5 version and Xbox versions also got this same update as well too. So if you guys are wondering. Also do Formula One yesterday if you guys watched it. Let me know in the comment section down below. I can't believe it. Verstappen and Hamilton, both going out early. Two different reasons, right? We had engine failure, and then we also had the, uh, I guess, the brake failure. Was that what it was? I don't really know what they uh, deemed it as. I didn't see it, but we're in the shop. I'm gonna bring down force feedback just a little bit more. We have our custom wheel on here, so I don't wanna, I don't wanna burn the motor out with that. Let's try the secondary camera here quickly. Oh, it went back to this. Why? Did it not save itself? I don't understand. This one looks around, that's cool. This one does not. Meant to do that. Okay, let's get out of here. Do a quick little exploration out of here. For 300 horsepower, this thing feels like it has about 800 horsepower. Can't go this way, no. Take a left here if you can. No! See what I'm saying? It's so deceiving. Like, I can make it that way. No, you can't. Big entry. Oh my, I did it again. I did it again. I cannot wrap my head around this thing being so short. There we go. We got it now. We're gonna take a right here. We also need another right. First right, right about here going in, right? Oh, next one, next one. Okay. That's not good. I mean, the best thing about this game is actually building your car and then bringing it out here, right? So the fact that we're just kind of bringing out this thing that's fully modified, it's definitely a little bit cheap. 
but I like the fact that they let us try this. But for sure, building your car up and then bringing it out here will be way more satisfying. And then, of course, right, you get your own mods and customization. But I like the fact that they at least let us uh, do it, right, and try it. So that is fully built. And I do believe we have engine swaps anyway, so I mean, we could probably go crazy with it if we really wanted, but... It's been... Oh, no, no. It's been too long. Jeez. One of the sloppiest runs ever. I don't know how many people are still playing Drift CE, but I see that they added a chaser, and I was down. Right, that's basically what it came down to. Not a lot of games are adding them. Don't know why. Oh, my God. I'd like to see Forza maybe do it once. That would be nice. There you go, trees. Sorry. Can I go this way? Oh, nice. I'm just gonna loop back here. Car doesn't really want to throw itself. Maybe I'm just not throwing it enough. Like, okay, there we go. That's a little first person. I do like this track. I'm curious if first person is going to make this game that much better. And I've always said this, that the view will make a difference on how the game feels. And, uh, point proven. Look at this. The game is feeling ten times different. I just like to get this same force feedback for the third person. They just don't have that weird angle, because I think that's what it is, right? It's the angle that really makes the camera go weird and then in turn makes force feedback go weird. But this is like night and day difference. Like, look at this. What? Like, you just get a nice fourth gear flick into this? Oh my god, I wanted to go that way so badly, man. Okay. Ah, oh, that was fun. That was fun. Okay, we're gonna, no, I almost did it again. Quit session. Holy jeez. Almost got me. Almost got me, Drift C. Take that button out. Like, we shouldn't be able to quit the game completely from the pause menu in a race. That shouldn't be a thing. I wanted to do this summer trip event. Bring it around with a trailer, man. This is so cool, the fact that they actually have this in here. I just wish there was more people on track with it, though. Do we actually have the trailer behind me? Oh my goodness, we do. Look at it! What am I looking at? Can I look around? No, I can't. Why not? I want to look around. Oh, there we go. Yes! We're going to the track with our trailer. Whipping it. Trailer's whipping too. Oh, no. Okay, hold on. I got it. Oh, we took off dynamic camera for the roof. I like this. It's just it's a little bit like... <laughs> why are we like on the middle of the roof? We're in the sunroof, man. Remember, we have a trailer behind us. Somehow we're actually sideways. I'd love to see this in the third part in the actual replays. Good, right? Yeah. I'm just parking it for the night. That's all. Look at this spot. Like, we actually started whipping it there. Like, look at this. Even the trailer's drifting. Oh, man. That's so cool. Drifty added a trailer and a chaser. I mean, the trailer was already in there, but go ahead. Quit session. I missed this game on the wheel. 100%. Let's see if anyone's on multiplayer. Is there? Stadium 1. 1 out of 6. We're going in. We don't even have a car. Oh, I do. It's Drift Ready, too. Let's go. Oh, there he is. Oh, he's got the new Supra, too. How you doing? He's going, he's going. We're in his lobby right now, so... I would also like to get this view off of there. Why do I gotta run? I don't even know where I'm going. Right here, but just kind of 
throwing it aimlessly into the corners. Oh no! Wow, Drift CE tandems. I never thought I'd see the day on this game. Who's that guy? So we got him. Where's he going? Online servers are still kicking. I can't believe it. I'm happy to see it though. People are still on this game. No matter how many people it is, right? Never want to see a game go extinct. Especially Drift CE, man. I love this game. And I really do hope that they keep adding in. I'd love to see them do like a competition tune setup or something like that. We actually have to build your car and then bring it in as fast as you can and then do like a drift lap or something like that. How crazy would that be? They have the tools, I feel like. They just have to get the online setup for it, but even like a single player mode. Okay, we're gonna quickly bring down Force You Back even more. That BMW's behind us. Try. Yeah, no, I bounced off the wall. There we go. Just a tap for him. Yeah, definitely uh, enjoying Drift CE. Let me know if you guys are down below. Huge thanks for coming around for it. We're gonna get the overtake. Yep. Hey, I'll see you guys back here tomorrow. We're gonna try and actually do a build on this thing. If you guys want to see it, let me know which engine I should do. If I should just leave the 1J in, comment 1J. If should I drop a V8, drop a V8 in the comments, man. Huge thanks for coming around. I'll see you guys back here tomorrow. I'm out. Peace.